Hello, living in Boulder Vlog for August 7th, 2019, Wednesday. Currently, it's 1.15 a.m. on August 8th, Thursday. So I'm doing the thing. It's a new strategy, and I really like it, where I go a week. I start paying attention to the weeks. So I start on, like, Monday. I mean, this is if it's convenient. This has been working out for the last couple of weeks, because I did, like, through loops with... Atlantis based from Monday to Sunday and then I did a week with Boulder Rum Boulder History of Boulder on my website and then now I'm gonna do Boulder Rome um my fantasy land connecting Rome with Boulder and um um I'm gonna do a week and if I and if I'm you know not in the middle of something or I'm relatively reasonably satisfied with uh, where I am. I'll do a week on something else. And so the other week I want to do next week would be uh, links for the timeline. It's been so long since I've worked on my timeline. And my timeline still doesn't have uh, the links fixed from vertical to horizontal. Only on the uh, North Europe, 1500 to 2000 and South Europe, uh, zero to 500, I think are the only ones. So to go in there and to just boom, 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 boom for a week, that would be really amazing. Uh, give me a sense of accomplishment and take the timeline itself to a new level functionally. Um, I could actually use it, you know, it's not really usable for me because right now, cause when I look at it, I, the first thing I want to do is click on the King to go down to the vertical and then click it again to go up the horizontal and just dance around. Did you pop back and forth and none of the links are working. So uh, if I could fix all of those in a week, I'd be like, wow, yeah, next level, you know. Um, so I'd like to do that. Um, and then maybe pop back and do a week of uh, maybe Boulder and then go back to Boulder, Rome for a week. I don't know. I'm kind of afraid to go to Rome. Um, although, um, I don't know, you know, I, I was doing pretty good with Rome. I got kind of burned out with it, but I did a really good push with Rome this summer. And, um, I, 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 I stopped it on the uh, aqueducts. I was working on the aqueducts, finding the, uh, the, the mount, the fountains, the long ones, Aqua Triana, I think. Um, but, um, yeah, I don't know how much longer with Rome. That, that's a good two or three months on that one just to hammer out. But, um. But yeah, to work on the timeline. Oh, plus though, what I'm working on now is Boulder Rome. And today, um, it's there was a lot of unfinished stuff with Boulder Rome. I really, I remember when I built it, it was a big Blitzkrieger. Um, I don't remember exactly what order it was. I did Boulder and then I did Rome. And then maybe that's when I burnt out on Rome. And maybe it was after Rome. I did Boulder Rome for a little bit. But it wasn't that long. I just went into this Blitzkrieg where I dumped a bunch of stuff and then bailed and so right now what I could do is, you know, finish the town. There's two big mountain towns there on the tops of mountains. And I was working on one today, tracing the houses on there and then deleting the images. Um, it's a really heavy file, that Boulder Rome. It was 424 and I, megabytes. And I think maybe from all the images on there. And so I've been dumping those after creating. Polygon tool building stuff is less, is less heavy than the images, I think. But um, so... And then, uh, so then I started being like, okay, yeah, well, let's just tra tra trace all the images because there's lots of images of stuff up in the mountains of Boulder Room. I jam-packed the area above Timberline and Boulder with uh, structures to make it, to bring the whole area alive and make it like a completely inhabited, well-known area, you know, because it's so beautiful up there, so, and it's so close, so, um, and it's so, um, you know, it's free of people. You go up there and it's just nature, so you can build whatever you want, you know, with no distractions of structures or also to go out there as a magical. So, um, so yeah, I, that's a lot of work to just trace the stuff that I built up there and that I placed on there. Um, and so that's what I'm going to do, I think, for the next few days, you know, until Sunday. And then, uh, and then, you know, if I'm still working on it and I'm not done, I'm like, hey, let's do another week. I can see myself do another week on that. And then, you know, uh, and, and incorporate it into the website. I also want to incorporate Atlantis into my website. I built, I built it on Google Earth, but I didn't, you know, put it on the website, on the web page yet. And that would be amazing, too. So that's probably coming up really soon as well. So, um, but I'm, 
yeah, pleased with how much I'm working, how well I'm working. Um, I got a little margarita drink at the supermarket today, and uh, I should have bought two, because that would have been a party, because it was really tasty to drink, but now it's past midnight, can't buy them anymore. But, um, um, yeah, so I haven't really been listening that much, although recently I started listening to the history of Charlemagne. Haven't really been paying that much attention to it, but, um, so, um, I'm, uh, uh I'm, um, uh, uh, let's see, by tomorrow, I'm going to work a little bit more, you know, I still have energy. I got up really late today. It was like two in the morning, working until six, until two. So it's eight hours of sleep, but totally getting nocturnalized. Um, but by tomorrow when I do the video, if it's 24 hours from now, hopefully by next to by tomorrow, I will have, um, yeah, there's lots of stuff in Boulder room, you know, like right now I collected all the different park amenities. And so now I'm converting them into little polygon tools instead of big icons so that it doesn't cloud up the area. I think I'm gonna also take away the background. I have similar color backgrounds. I'll just put them there on their own to make to to use it for another, you know, background view. But to have it <laughs> natural is, I think, more more realistic. And um, yeah, you have to be able to see the ground. So I'll look at that when I look at that when I get ready to it and just see, just look at it. You know, gets really high and see what I see and if there's anything I want to add and then that'll be it with Boulder Rum. Oh, but then there's the battles I have to do and yeah, that might be a while, um, but we'll see. Maybe it won't, maybe I can get into the rhythm, you know? When I say battles of Boulder Rum, I mean like battles of all the battles of Rome and then create them, recreate them in Boulder at the same exact distance from Boulder as in the reality of Boulder Rum, of Rome, the distance, so. Yeah, but, you know, if I get in a rhythm, I do pretty good. Okay, so, <sighs> yawning a lot. So, yeah, um, talk to you tomorrow. But, yeah, um, yeah, hopefully maybe by tomorrow I'll be done with the two big cities, the two big towns, and then I'll know how many, how, what their population and how many houses there are. I haven't figured that one out yet. That'll be interesting. But you can download it now, Boulder Rome, off my website. Um, and see where I'm at. Um, all right, peace out. Talk to you tomorrow.